Hello, today is a great day, and I'm excited to show you the fascinating process of how farmers produce various fruits, vegetables, and design interesting machinery in agriculture. Now, let's take a look at these interesting production processes. Chili peppers belong to the Solanaceae family and Capsicum genus. The origin of chili peppers can be traced back to the Latin American region, especially Mexico. Indigenous people in Latin America had been using chili peppers for thousands of years before Europe encountered them after Christopher Columbus's discovery in the 15th century. Over time, chili peppers have diversified and undergone selective breeding, resulting in various types with different flavors and levels of spiciness. Each type of chili pepper can be used in multiple dishes and significantly influences the cuisine of different cultures worldwide. Soil is a crucial factor in the chili pepper growth process. The ideal pH for chili peppers is between 6.0 and 6.8, promoting optimal nutrient absorption. Many farmers choose organic farming to keep the soil rich in organic matter and reduce chemical use. Chili peppers come in many different varieties with varying levels of spiciness, shapes, and colors. Identifying your purpose for using chili peppers, whether for raw consumption, sauce processing, seasoning, or creating specific spiciness, will help you choose the appropriate type. The use of machinery in chili pepper cultivation helps save time and labor. A seed drill is used for even distribution of chili pepper seeds across the field, with adjustable seed spacing for suitable planting density. An irrigation system ensures the necessary moisture for chili pepper plants. This can be achieved through drip irrigation or field irrigation. Chili peppers thrive in warm temperatures, with the optimal range being 20 degrees Celsius to 30 degrees Celsius, 68 to 86 degrees Fahrenheit. The minimum temperature for chili pepper growth is typically around 15 degrees Celsius 59 degrees Fahrenheit. Planting chili peppers in areas with direct sunlight for 6 to 8 hours per day is best for their development. Planting is usually done in spring or summer. A cultivator removes weeds and cultivates the soil around chili pepper plants to improve drainage and nutrition.
the depth and width of the cultivator's plow can be adjusted. A fertilizer spreader is used to automatically supply fertilizer when the chili pepper plants need it. It can be designed to provide different types of fertilizer depending on the plant's growth stage. A harvester, a self-propelled machine, efficiently harvests chili peppers. It can be adjusted to harvest peppers at the desired level of spiciness. A pepper picker is used to accurately harvest chili peppers, avoiding damage to the plants or fruits. It can be automatic or operated by a driver. The machine for sorting peppers typically employs image sensors or machine learning technology to classify different types of peppers based on specific parameters. Utilizing a sorting machine enhances production efficiency, reduces waste, and ensures consistent product quality. Consumers are increasingly interested in organic products, creating a special market for organic chili peppers. The production and consumption of organic chili peppers are becoming a significant trend in the agricultural industry. Chili peppers are mostly consumed in various markets, supermarkets, and country fairs. That concludes a video introducing the production, harvesting, and consumption processes of chili peppers that we produce. If you find it interesting, please leave a like, a comment, and subscribe to the channel for more insights into the production and consumption processes of industrial foods. For now, goodbye, everyone.